What's up guys, Kidmar95 here bringing you another episode. In today's episode we have a technical analysis on Zcash here. Currently up about 3% for the day sitting at $140. But we're looking at the BTC value sitting at about 2.1 million Satoshis, also up about 3%. So really quick before we start this video, let's go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. Market cap sitting at 218 billion. Today's volume is slightly below 15 billion. Bitcoin dominance almost back up to 52%. Not much has changed for BTC, still sitting at 6.5. Same with Ethereum, still sitting at about 220. Ripple still hanging out at about 53 cents. Looks like the altcoins are the big winners today, however. Bitcoin Cash up about 9, sitting at 561. EOS slightly in the green. Lumens up about 4, sitting at 26. Litecoin up 7, sitting at 63. Looks like we finally broke 58. Cardano back up above 8. Monero back up above 115. IOTA back up above 55. Dash is still below 200. Tron making its way back up to 2.5. And, and NEO making its way back up to about 20. Big winners today, Electronium up about 39, Eternal Token up about 26, and GX Chain up about 18. Big losers, Metaverse down 10, Tesos down 6.5, ooh, excuse me, and R Chain down about 6 and a quarter. Two folks came in for some Z Chain, market cap sitting at 689 million. Today's volume is 137 million, circulating supply 4.8 million. Major exchanges, L Bank, Bitthumb. Kyobi, HitBTC, Bitfinex, Binance, Kraken, and Bittrex. First things first, folks, BTC to USD on the daily. Looking kind of bullish right now, actually, folks, not going to lie. Got a higher high up there. First of all, higher low. This low, beat, this, low beat, this low beat this low. This high beat this high. And now we came back down and tested 6,400 for support. Actually, it looks like we found it. Um... Had a little bit of a test here and then some exhaustion, indecision. If we get a nice little engulfing or at least a close above 6,500, I definitely expect us to make a push towards the upside. If we shift over to the four hours, we do see a double bottom here, bottom one, bottom two. Next entry here, that four hour break and close above 6,500 or 6,530 to be exact. 6,530 and we should see a push towards the upside. Ethereum to USD, same thing, formed a higher low, higher high. Looks like we got our higher low here at about 213, 215. Now waiting for that uh, four hour break and close. Let's go ahead and shift over to the four hour. Waiting for that four hour break and close, folks, above 219. Once we get that four hour break and close above 219, should see a nice push towards the upside from about 219 up to about 245. This one's looking really bullish, if you ask me. Litecoin here, higher low, higher high, higher low. Very strong push from 57 up to 63. Definitely looks like we'll be getting that uh, four hour close above $61. If we get that four hour close above $61, should see a push from about 61 all the way up to about 76, 75. But remember, just my personal opinion, not a financial advisor. But you folks came here for some Zcash to BTC. We're looking at the weekly here. Zcash is, I love looking at this chart. So, first we thought we had all time lows here at 2.6 million. And then again here at what are we at? Slightly below two billion or two million. Then we formed another one over here at 1.8. However, on the weekly momentum definitely starting to shift towards the upside. If we go ahead and zoom in a little bit, it does look like a Z chain, or I'm sorry, Z chain. Z cash here did break our nice little aggressive downtrend. Shift over to the daily. Bottom one, bottom two. Came back down, we broke out of this, came back down to test for support, and now we're heading towards the upside. What I'm waiting for, folks, is I'm waiting for, it looks like we're actually going to be getting it too, so I'll probably be taking a position after this video. I was, wait, I was waiting for that daily break and close above 2.1 million Satoshis, 2.1, to be exact, but that's a lot of numbers, so I'm just going to say 2.1 million. Uh, it's basically the yellow line. If we get a daily break and close above this level, we should see a nice push towards the upside. Where do I see this coin going in 2018? Currently sitting at 2.1. I think this coin could easily come up to about 4.5 by the end of 2018, if not early 2019. But that's pretty much it for today's video, guys. Don't forget to re-steam, upvote. Keep commenting down below what kind of coins you guys are trying to see. If you guys are on YouTube, make sure you guys subscribe. If you have post notifications turned on, I do post a new video every single day. Other than that, guys, thanks for watching. Take it easy. Peace.